is how could I corrupt or break Bitcoin? So there is a way, um, and there is a there's a few there's a uh, there's a few things happening on the planet that are a little bit worrying. But here's what I think of them. So there is a way that you could break or corrupt Bitcoin. But the, the, what you'd need to do is assemble uh, uh, processing power that represented over half of the Bitcoin network. So you'd either, either need to take over one of the biggest pools and then pump it up uh, until you had 51, 52% of the network hashing rate. Um, then, so you'd be making a substantial investment in time, money, and energy to hijack something and make it worthless. So it doesn't seem that there's an incentive to do that. Uh, and also, um, you know, if you, if you wanted to set up a mining operation specifically to hijack 51% of the network, then you would be talking about an enormous investment. Um, so it just doesn't make sense. It's an, it's, it's z there's zero incentive to corrupt Bitcoin or to try and take control of the network in that way. Then the second, the second risk with Bitcoin is quantum computing, which I don't fully understand. I'm by no means an expert. I'm a enthusiastic amateur, but quantum computing seems to uh, offer processing power uh, in an unparalleled manner. Uh, so in theory, um, a quantum computer could attempt to hijack the Bitcoin network, but here's how I see this developing. So initially quantum computers will be the preserve of governments and institutions. And I think it's highly unlikely that they're gonna use it to attack anything. Uh, and then secondly, as time goes by and quantum computing becomes more accessible, well, there's going to be quantum mining computers. So the the advances in processing technology means that the Bitcoin difficulty and network hash rate uh, shoots up uh, in conjunction with the arrival of um, quantum computing. So that's what I think is likely to happen. Um, but that's the way you could, in theory, break Bitcoin. But I don't see that as a, uh, I don't see that as a, as a real risk or a, even a vaguely sensible thing to do.